guys, welcome to my channel. You're watching my channel C by 86. I'm Shivali, and thanks for spending some time with me right here on YouTube. So today is going to be a makeup tutorial, as you can all see. 15th August is Independence Day, so I am doing an Independence Day theme makeup tutorial inspired by the colors of the Indian flag. That's the white, green, and orange or saffron. And this is what I came up with, a green um, smoky eye and it's got hints of orange on the crease and the dark, 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 dark outer V. That is the look which we'll be doing today, this Independence Day Indian flag inspired makeup tutorial. And if you want to know how I did this look, then continue to watch. So the first thing is we are going to apply a tape following the line of our lower lash line up to the brow bone and then we are going to prime our eyes. I am using the e.l.f. eyelid primer that is going to go all over the lid and your lower lash line pretty much where you plan to put your eyeshadow. We are going to apply an eyeshadow primer to prevent creasing and also to make the colors pop like the first base to go on is this NYX Jumbo Pencil in the shade Milk and that will go at the inner third of your eye. You can use a small concealer brush to blend it all out because the inner corners are tricky to reach. The second base is going to be green and I am using this Very Me Double Trouble Eyeliner Pencil. This is in the shade Green Goddess. This looks a little bit blue on camera but it's green, I swear. And that is going in the middle of your lid. And this is really, really creamy, so you can blend it out really well. Third base is going to be this black eyeliner. This is again Very Me Double Trouble Pencil. And this is in the shade Night Sky. That is going to go on your outer V, and that is also going to be blended out. After that, from the 120 palette, I am going to take a white shimmering eyeshadow and that is going on top of your white base with a petite brush. This is from Eco Tools. The green, which has a slightly a touch of gold to it, that is going with a shader brush and that is going on top of your green base in the middle of your lid. And I love how the, there are tiny gold reflects in it. And the third one is going to be this shimmery black color that is going on top of your black base. Now you need to be careful with the black because you don't want the whole look to be dark or gothic. That will just go at the outer corner and that is going to be slightly brought in into the crease as well. Then I'm going to going to take this beautiful orange color and with a blending brush I'm going to start to place that color on the crease area and don't do don't do this like all at one go take small amounts of orange and then slightly blend out the black using the orange then taking the same white eyeshadow that is going to go on the brow bone and also that will give the orange something to blend against so that it fades away into the beautiful thing. I'm using gel eyeliner which is the Maybelline Drama gel eyeliner and that is just going to be just the usual eyeliner thingy that we do. And I'm going to line my lower lash line also with that. However, I'm going to stop at the inner third. Smoke down your waterline with any black eyeliner pencil. I'm using the Maybelline Colossal Smudge Free Kajal. Then I'm going to use false lashes. I'm using a natural pair. There's nothing much to say on applying false lashes. Just apply it. I'm going to curl my lashes. Apply mascara. I'm using the Maybelline Volume Express. Now for contouring, I'm going to use this Lotus Contouring product. And that is going to go, 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 go along your cheekbones and your temples. For blush, I'm using this orangey peachy blush from Color Essence in the shade Peach Affair and that is going on the apples of your cheeks and side swiped along your cheekbones. The lips are going to be a nude color and that is Oriflame lipstick in the shade Vintage Nude. So that is the completed look. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I hope you got your own ideas through it. And I did my nails by the Independence Day theme. If you want to watch the tutorial for it, I will link it 
here yeah right there you can go and watch the tutorial and please comment rate and subscribe your comments blah, blah, blah. please comment rate and subscribe your comments mean a lot to me and thanks for watching commenting rating and subscribing and until i see you guys next time bye all pictures of this look and my other makeup looks will be available on my Facebook page and I wish all of you a very very happy Independence Day. Jai Hind!